Hey there. Where are you headed? You gave a ride to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little... What's all the ruckus out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl here? Guess. We want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what's she look like? Well... She's in great shape. Is that really important? Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Having scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon, if at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? <laughs> what are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. Uh, and there goes our best lead yet. <sighs> Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. today, boy. It's just like I've been saying. There's no faster thing on two legs than you. Watch out, Gold Saucer. A new champion. Headed to town real. Real soon. Delivery isn't due for inspection. Huh? These ones addressed to Don Corneo? Yes, idiot. Those ones. Trust me, kid. There's a lot of things you're better off not knowing. Uh, got it. Huh? These ones addressed to Don Corneo? Yes, idiot. Those ones. Welcome to Walmart, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. 
So, what kind of mischief you looking to get up to tonight? You gotta let go of your inhibitions and set yourself free! Indulge your wildest fantasies. What happens here stays here. After all, baby, you're in Wall Market. That's just how we do. So, what kind of mischief you looking to get up to tonight? This is the one there. Step right up, step right up. It's the fully automated, state-of-the-art item Pretty procurement machine. Place, That's what folks from all over come here for. Get rowdy, let loose. Oh, look at that glow. What is it? Why, it's the Walmart Ocean Juice. Hey there. We're a pharmacy, but we stock other stuff too. I said they're good. Huh? Try one. Hey, that's not what you promised. How with you and your additional charges? Who's that? Don Corneo. Who else? Wait, hold on. That's right. You're gonna pay your tab either with you. Hey, that's not what you 
you promised! To hell with you and your additional charges! Yeah. The boss isn't gonna like that. Think you're too good for my funds? Come here! What the hell, man? Quit picking fights with the customers! So sweet. So rich. Oh, Marcus. Try something else for a change. Who are you? And what have you done with my husband? You are just as bad. Admit it. I mean, yeah. It's the hardest way to go. So weird. I sworn it was in my pocket. What do you look like? You two! Yes, you. Do you have a place to stay this enchanted evening? We have the perfect room for a sweet-looking couple like you. How much? Cloud! <laughs> Just give me a holler when you change your mind. So, where are the shady areas? That's easy. Anywhere with a bunch of shady-looking people hanging. Like, right where we're standing? Welcome. Are you in need of accommodations? It's quite crowded at the moment, but I'll see what I can do. Have a safe trip. You know, I've heard from more than a few people that my son Johnny has been roaming the streets of Wall Market. Before he leaves town, I need to make sure I deliver him his lucky pillow. I have faith in my boy, of course, but a growing man needs plenty of sleep, sleep of good quality, no less. That's how mind and body stay healthy and active. In other words, this pillow is crucial to his health. <laughs> This is 
what I get for being a cheapskate. A room with a hooligan. Just gotta wait till Sunday. She'll pass out. Don't know about you, but this place sure is a lot weirder than I thought it was. Yeah? What did you expect? You know, something less... what I get for being a cheapskate. A room with a hole in it. What? That idea is even less of a That guy's doing okay? He wasn't looking so hot, you know. Maybe we should go check on him? But this street, isn't it? The one that everyone says is bad news? Shit, you're right. I don't want to go down there now. No place to hang out. You feel me? Ain't nobody gonna give a shit if you get your throat cut here. Hey, bro, this ain't ain't nobody gonna give a shit if you get your throat cut here. Taken care of. The only thing is, the newbie screwed up, got spotted by a tourist. And you best see to that. Aren't you a curious cat, walking dark alleys? You've got balls, so I'll give you a pass. This once.
Wait, you don't mean the newbie too, right? I said deal with it. Can't have this coming back on Sam or the dog. You didn't see or hear anything. Oh, kid. You get me? I know you're not telling me to move. Wait, you don't mean the newbie too, right? I said deal with it. Can't have this coming back on Sam or the Dawn. I understand. Mommy? May I please have some more? Just a yep. little huh? more. Best to steer clear of this alley. You may not like the people you find down here, and they may not like you. We're cool though, just blowing off work is all. We're not up to anything, honest. We just want a second away to relax. You don't need more than one copy. I hope you like them as much as I do. The first train shipper created to support Midgar's interest. Promise to spend more next time. I pinky promise. The cow cow, the squeeze squeeze, the moo moo, I'll buy it all. My apologies, sir. We are not ready to open at this time. You're not going to see a show as captivating as this anywhere else. Marlita's 
the greatest honey girl there ever was. It's an undisputed truth, and I dare anyone try and deny it. I dare. You are wrong, sir. Folia may be new, but she is clearly the best, and the only one worthy of being called the greatest. No, no way! You've lost your marbles, man! My marbles are secure, sir. Tis you who are crazy. Yes, it's always best to be prepared for the worst, wouldn't you agree? Quality monster insurance is more essential than ever these days. Huh. Marlita's the greatest honey girl there ever was. It's an undisputed truth, and I dare anyone try and deny it. I did. You were wrong, sir. Only a baby you, but she is clearly the What? Uh, aren't you that leaf house? Uh, hey! What the hell, Merc? Digging into people's personal affairs in this town is a huge no-no. What are you doing here? Uh, well, if you must know, I've wanted to be a dancer ever since I was a little girl. I come here at night to live the dream. Uh, I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell the children, okay? I've always wanted to dance for a living. I've always wanted to dance for a living. I practice every second I can. It's the only way I'll become the best. Sharp though. Lifetime bands a lifetime ban. Street just over there? You're not still wasting your gill at the Honeybee Inn, are you? <laughs> you bet I am! Found me a secret route in, one nobody don't know about. Only trouble is, it's filled with drunks and garbage. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Place is full. Hey! You hear about that real narrow street, just You're not still. <laughs> you bet I am. How me a Are you sure about this, man? Corneo's gonna use it. Come on. Give it to me, please. I'm begging you, miss. Get away. Uh, that sense. I can't stand it. <laughs> Maybe this is the 
warm, relaxation, the sweet embrace of real Enter. That is the question. Wherefore does this philosophical quandary torment me? You totally get where I'm coming from, right? Yeah, I should have figured. You're not the philosophical introspective type like me. That soft, naive face. I know you're kind well, bro. You're just another musclehead who uses violence to work through your inner demons. It's sad, really. Huh? Yeah, what's up? Seen Tifa around? Tifa? My love? My light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up. I don't care. Tifa's here? Why? Tell me why! Oh god, no. I did this to her, didn't I? She came looking for me to beg me not to leave her. <gasps> Snap out of it, Johnny. Your Tifa needs you! Tifa, I'm coming, baby! Who was that? Nobody you want or need to know. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the Dung's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute! Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith, 
Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. If you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. If you're hell-bent on getting in, then go bother the trio. Sure about this? If you've got any better ideas. Not really. So that's the way it is. <laughs> Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. See the sign out front? All I got is materia. Thanks, buddy. Talk about a busy day, huh? But what do you say we grab a drink? A boost. There's this energy pulsing from my fingertips. Do you believe the bargains in this part of town? There's so many
I feel rejuvenated. I guess they're closed right now? Let me handle Andrea. this. Curse you wait out here, will. okay? Then why would I do that? No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that... You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. Good evening. Oh. Hey, uh. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh, we don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required, and the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes. Well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare. But Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. Hey, are you nervous too? You bet I am! This is the first time in my life sitting in the premiere section. It took me over half a year to save up for this. Wow! I hope you enjoy the show. Alas, most of the audience can't appreciate the true meaning of his work. Friend, grab a seat. Any seat that's open. So, what will it be? Okay. 
If you want a recommendation, try the recommended special. Hey there, friend. Grab a seat. Any seat that's open. Sure about that? You still got room for more? Made a little extra. Want to spend it on some good eating. The other joints in town got nothing on this place. Food and drink and everything. Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, here's out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> yes, wrong. And you'll leave me in peace. Heads. Tail. You lose. Hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio and not just the Mio. Now skip daddle. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? Trick coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating! And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. You gotta let go of your inhibitions and set yourself free! We can arrange this. <laughs> There's something down right now. Oh, shit! Johnny's been had. She's a siren, I tell you. When Gil. Oh, Johnny's been had. She's a siren, I tell you. There's something down there. This must be the place. place. Hmm. Welcome, welcome. Just the two of you? Step right up. Now then, what manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm-hmm. We are a hand massage parlor. 
An excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> and what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don Cook. Love Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Uh. Uh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... <laughs> hmm... Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! The strong, firm hands of a fighter, yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? Hey, you don't have enough for that. Why don't you choose a course you can actually afford? Hm. If you're not a customer, then get out. Ready to take the plunge, are we? So, which court? Hm. If you're not a customer, then get out. Oh. There's this energy pulsing from my fingers. Think I'm calling the night. Thanks, call my name. Well, now that you mention it, we do have an early story hmm. tomorrow. You got Gil? Okay. Gotta think about the combinations. Talk about a busy day, huh? I feel pretty stupid. Alive. I got a brand new body. Ready to take the plunge, are we? So, which course will it be? <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back and wait. Cloud? I should warn you, this technique has certain risks. Huh? It's somewhat experimental. You may find it extremely pleasurable and rewarding. Or the opposite. Uh, wait. Absolutely not. You asked for this. Now take it like a man! Everything hurts. You'll enjoy it more next time. Do come again. How was it? Not now. Maybe not ever. Did something happen to you in there? Just... 
give me a sec. Just one? Uh, maybe a few minutes. Hmm. Think you'll make a habit of it? Then, I think I've seen everything I need to see. So? Tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. Oh, so you don't need that favor? Sure you're okay? Yeah. Sure you're okay? Yeah. Sure you're okay? Yeah. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm? Okay. Really? But you cannot go dress like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate wearing such a plain-looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? It's alright, I guess. <laughs> oh, you. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes, for the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. 